So as we come together today, let us include in our circle all those that in their higher selves are part of our circle and not with us today. As we connect around our circle to each other and feel through the energy rising upwards out of our crown, our connection to all those in their higher selves who are connecting with us now. Let us move into our breath as we simply breathe, breathing in the breath of life, coming to us from source itself, the one source moving through all things as we breathe in the light, the love of source. So the Octurians and many others have been with us, preparing and ready for the work we are about to do. So let us allow ourselves to receive, firstly from the Octurians, a cleansing and healing for ourselves. This will be simply received as it is given to us by grace as we slowly rise into a higher frequency, allowing ourselves to receive You may feel the light entering through your third eye. You find your body relaxing and your focus moving away from the mind to the high heart. We feel our consciousness rising and expanding, the connection to our circle becoming more tangible and the experience of receiving the energies from so many star beings, angels and dark angels, ascended masters, as they all come together to work through us. As we as channels become increasingly purified to enable us to hold these higher frequencies which are now moving through us.
as they descend from above, we also feel our connection to the earth. Our energy is moving through the crystalline grid and connecting to Gaia, her heart, her soul, her consciousness. And we allow her energy to rise. As her energies come into our circle, you feel them moving upwards through your body, through your aura. From within your high heart, you begin to feel your oneness, your oneness with Gaia, your planet. And your oneness with the higher beings of light as we invite them to move closer to move within as we begin to feel a merging. The beings of Sirius, of Lyra, of Juris, the Pleiades, and even beings from beyond this universe, all here to assist. Your experience comes through resting in relaxation, your awareness, your centre in your high heart. We come to the place of non-doing within our hearts. So that all may freely pass through us. As Jesus said, of myself I do nothing. It is the Father who works through me. There are many starships above the valley in Tregora. You may feel their presence above you, wherever you are. Let us begin by moving our focus to Shregara. As we see that violet light descending Mother Mary is there, Mary Magdalene is there, Lord Merlin is there. And of course the Arcturian. We simply now focus in our mind's eye of this valley, knowing roughly where it is in Spain. And those of you that wish to can move through upward through an Arcturian blue corridor of light, which is here for each of us. To rise up and 
and move our consciousness by thought into this valley where in our consciousness we all meet in our circle. Take a few moments to feel your consciousness there and to begin to receive from the many beings that have come through this portal to be with us. So now we simply allow, allow the entrance through this portal of all the higher beings that wish to enter and feel the presence of Gaia as she receives into her heart and being. The presence of higher consciousness which she so needs to assist her in her ascension back into the higher dimension. Nothing for you to do, simply to be to be in your presence and allow or to move through you. You may receive visions of what is taking place but if you do, it does not matter. It is what you feel within your heart that is important. You do not need to know what is taking place. You feel the angelic love that is moving through so many rays. The healing ray of the green. the pink ray of love, the blue ray of the divine feminine, and so on. It is taking some of the load off of Gaia as transmutation takes place when needed most. This area is quite pure and allows the energies to spread far and wide. It is said to be the lungs of Europe as we breathe in the energy of the Pyrenees. You can drive for miles there without seeing a house, a village, a town.
the Arcturians connect again, trigger off to Igor Lava on the Mediterranean. this huge energy spreads far and wide and from its centre here in the mountains it moves out to Shaftesbury, Glastonbury and Stonehenge, the centre of Gaia's heart chakra. And from Stonehenge to the Greenwich Meridian through to London and our meditation base there. So be still within while all takes place. And the Arcturians are beginning to connect this portal to other places, sacred places in surrounding areas. In fact, it is moving through the entire planet is connecting to sacred sites. To the Arturian etheric crystals that have been laid within the planet. It is also travelling to areas upon the planet where it is most needed. Stonehenge is one of the most powerful sites on the planet comparable to the Great Pyramid of Egypt. It was designed for energies to pass through to the centre of the planet and be taken to where it is most needed. Let us now ask for the connection 
from Stonehenge to the Great Pyramid of Egypt. And see or feel how Gaia's energy is rising to meet, to receive all that is coming down from above. So as we continue to hold our focus, the energies build in power, in strength, moving ever more energy through this planet and beyond. And the planet is beginning to feel lighter. And we also in our circle are feeling lighter and moving up in frequency.
So perhaps time now to return to be continued later. So all in our circle here in this valley, let us move back into the Arcturian corridor of blue light and let them bring us back into our bodies. You feel yourself re-entering slowly in alignment through your physical, down to your connection to the earth. Feeling present, aligned, and grounded, anchored into your physical body and anchored into the earth. Knowing your consciousness is without limit and your consciousness can still be aware of what is taking place energetically in that valley and beyond as you prepare yourself to open your eyes and maintain that flow through you, the divine working through you and your divine self.